Hello everyone, Mipa here, trying to make your Monday a little better and maybe even something to look forward to. We are here with the next two pages of scene six. Welcome! If you were here last week, you will remember that I had said the setting would be very different. And it is, as you can probably tell by now. This is the dungeons and I had quite a bit of fun doing the dungeons I had to make the brick walls on a separate canvas because I knew that I would absolutely die if I had to redraw every brick for every wall for every panel for every page. <laughs> I just, I just couldn't. So, like I did with the bookshelves, if you remember, I drew it on a separate canvas, so then whenever I need to put them on here, I use the little magic wand, I believe it's called, on Abyss Paint, to lasso an area or just select a big area so that when I essentially copy and paste the bricks onto the wall then it will stay within that area and it's just very convenient for me to do the bricks that way because if you can't already tell there are a lot of bricks <laughs> So we're doing it this way for my ease, and I think it still looks pretty good. I am still happy with how the walls look, and it just makes everything so much easier. This guard as well, this little girl here, I like her. I don't know why I like her a lot. I just think she's cute. I designed her on the spot. I don't have a reference for her because she's... Spoiler, she's not going to show up, really. So, I just kind of have her made on the spot, but I think she still looks cute. If I remember right, she's an elf. So, just so you know, there are elves in this universe, which I think is cool. There are a lot of different, like, I guess called humanoid variations. <laughs> in the world of We're What's Left, and Elves is one of them, but Dr. Arcade and Luca are just humans, there's nothing really special there, but she's an elf, and I had fun with her. I actually have a whole notebook for the building, or the world building, of We're What's Left for my personal reference on how things work, and I think I might go a little bit more into detail about that next week. If not next week, I will eventually, I know for sure. Go a little bit more into what's in that notebook, which I think is nice and fun. I don't think I'll show images of the notebook because it's all just words for the most part, but I'll just talk about what's in it. But yes, this girl is an elf and I like her. Do you guys think she's cute? I just think she's a cute little guard. Guards are supposed to be, like, strict and stuff, but she isn't. And I don't know why, but she is. And I like her for that. But that is all I have for this week's ramble. I hope you all enjoyed, and I hope I'll see you all next week. Goodbye!